Hey, good morning, Amanda. As of now, 30 cities across the country and one in Spain are expected to be a part of this rally. And this is in response to the growing number of immigrant children being separated from their families as they cross the U.S. Mexico border. Throughout this entire week, Central Texas mothers have been fighting against this policy and demanding Senator John Cornyn call on the Trump administration to end the policy. Today's rallies are happening after reports of nearly 1,500 children have gone missing. Health and Human Services uh, say that these kids who allegedly went missing were among thousands who arrived at the border last year without parents. It claims they were not separated and most are still living with the adult sponsors they were placed with. Attorney General Jeff Sessions said earlier that authorities would start prosecuting every person suspected of having crossed the border illegally. If you are smuggling a child, then we will prosecute you. And that child may be separated from you as required by law. We must combat this inhumane practice and all those that are carrying it out and stand up for the ideas and the freedom that this country represents, not to move toward authoritarianism as Trump would have us do. In a perfect world, I'd like Senator Cornyn to stand up and say that this is wrong and that this needs to stop and that children should stop being separated from their families, that this policy by the Trump administration truly is horrific. It, it damages children, it damages family, and it's not who we are as Americans at all. The rally starts this afternoon at 4.30 here at Republic Square. Members and supporters of at least 15 groups will be here, including Congressman Lloyd Doggett.